Cooking Appa. Hi, this is Cooking Appa. Today I'm going to deep fry some hair tail fish. Yeah, uh, it is very. It is as it looks. It's also called belt fish. It looks like a belt, and it is very very yummy, very tender. And uh, this is the first time in many years that I actually managed to buy this fish in my local uh, supermarket. Okay, very difficult to find, but it is not expensive. All right, I pay for I think about 18 ringgit for this whole fish. And yeah, and the easiest way to eat this is actually to uh, fry it. Okay, we spray it with some uh, some uh, salt, and we can fry it. If you are very scared of plattering, uh, avoid using a small pot like me. Okay, use a bigger pot or bigger pan. Now, you when you are frying, deep frying this fish, I always prefer deep frying than pan fry. Many people also pan fry this this uh, particular fish here. Okay, but I always feel deep fry is actually more. You will cover the fish more evenly. So, um, always use a very high temperature oil to deep fry your fish and it should be somewhere around 170 to 180 degrees. How you know that? First of all, use a chopstick and put it inside the oil and you can see a lot of bubbling. Secondly, you can see your, smoke is, uh, your oil is smoking. The moment you see your oil is smoking, it is already at least minimum 170 degrees and above. Okay, and then after that, do not flip your your fish so uh, frequently uh, the whole process within a couple of minutes you should only flip it two or three times maximum okay uh, don't keep flipping it because it will destroy your you will ruin your flesh the meat flesh okay so we will uh, we will let it cook one side for probably about two minutes because this this fish is very easy to be cooked so we will let it fry for about two minutes uh, other other bigger fish probably at least three four minutes this one probably two three minutes and then you will flip all right we we'll come back shortly. Okay, this is after about almost three minutes. You can uh, you can feel the, the you can hear the sizzling sounds getting lesser, bubbles getting lesser. Okay, so and then you can uh, gently push your fish, meaning it has the bottom part of the fish has already crispified nicely because it is moving right now. So this is the time where you can start flipping them. Look at the beautiful golden brown color. Push it to the edge of the, 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 the pan and flip it. You can use two spoons to, uh, to do this also can. Ooh, nice. Nice. Look at the beautiful golden brown color. This is exactly the kind of color we want. After flipping the first time, you will give it another probably about one to two minutes. Okay, and then I will maybe flip it one last time. Then it's ready. This is after another two minutes. I'm going to flip it one last round. Just for the sake of color, it's already cooked, okay? It is already cooked. Just for one last round for the color. See? The beautiful golden brown that we are getting. Just for a couple of seconds, it is actually okay. I'm doing this just for the sake of the color. And I don't want to overcook this. This one is done. See the beautiful golden brown color? This 
the, the this meat is very very sweet yeah and it goes very well with uh, light soy sauce and chili padi oops <laughs> Get off the fire. Okay, I hope you can see this clearly. All right, here's my uh, fried uh, hair tail fish. It is very yummy. Go and uh, try and look for it in your place. Hope you can find it. Um, if you like this uh, video, do share on your Facebook to your friends. Come to Cooking Up Facebook page to click above the like and follow button, and um, subscribe to Cooking Up YouTube channel and follow up on Instagram. Alright, I uh, hope you all can enjoy your dinner with your family. Bye bye!